And I is your copy. Do we? 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 Do A man and his wife, white people, they were talking to my mom and dad, and that man finally he said, would you like to come and live with us, little boy, he said. I was scooped out of Central Park at age five. Two of my cousins, they were picked up. He took the door handles off from the inside, so once he closed the door, the kids could open it. This is a special adoption program. We have had great difficulty in placing Indian and Métis children. There was thousands of us taken across the country. There's still thousands that are out there in the world right now, lost. From the late 1950s to the mid-1980s, tens of thousands of Indigenous kids were removed from their families and placed into white families. This is what we'd refer to as the 60 Scoop. Little Bird is a mini-series about one woman's experience after being abducted from her home in Saskatchewan and being adopted into a Jewish family in Montreal. Today, the scene I will be playing is the one when I get taken away from my mom and I get put in the cop car. What is a nation without its children? That's such a violent thing, you know? I don't think there's one Indigenous family that hasn't been impacted by residential school or the child welfare system. I want people to know that it's still alive. It's still happening. In the current system, which I call the foster care scoop, children are in foster care, and non-Indigenous people are getting a lot of money to take care of our children. I feel very honored to tell the story. It's an offering to come together and heal. It is about coming home. It's about welcoming those who were taken. And I think that this story in and of itself is about that. It's about reclaiming everything that we are as a people.